There we go. We're just wow. Is his brakes on? Oh my man! Natural vision about. Look at that. That's amazing. Get on the ground. Oh, get on the ground. Oh, shit. Damn! He pulled a gun on me. Pretty pit. Oh crap! Oh jeez! Let's just tap this guy right there. Get in the car. Get in the car. Okay. Uh, thank you, bulletproof windows. Get down on the ground. Welcome to Mike Golden Games and welcome back to LSPDFR. This episode is subscriber requested by Axon J and they wanted us to do a McGee PD patrol, which is in Mississippi. So I hope you guys will enjoy this one. This is actually the episode that didn't have any uh, desktop audio, just my microphone. So we're going to redo this one. Let's get around here. We are in Blue Ghost's 2014 Dodge Charger and the livery is done by, of course, Ocean's Bay. Once again, man, you did an amazing job. Look at this livery. I love the back card. Like, it looks really good with the McGee police on the back. I think the decals look really good. And the decal right up here on the front fender, I almost did the... I, I tried to do the uh, 5M uh, point. Uh, that doesn't work in LSPDFR. Uh, probably could get it to, but... Police McGee, Mississippi. All right, looks good. So let's get on patrol. Dispatch, you can show me 10-8. And looks good. Uh, so we're currently, we're on Polito Boulevard... Let's uh, just go down this way, and you know what? Actually, while we're here, I'm gonna do a little bit of radar checking. Uh, this vehicle, it's an Oracle, no flags. Oh, this lifted pickup truck looks a little sus. I didn't say that. Let, let's get a play check on it. Oh. Uh, okay, okay, we'll allow that, we'll allow that. He was a little preemptive on that turn there, but that's all right. We'll get down this way and just go down past the bank. We'll just basically be patrolling around Polito today, so I hope you guys do enjoy this episode. This Hummer just blew that red light. Okay, Dispatch, we got a, uh, it's a silver Hummer. They just blew a red light. Hey, Josh. Pull over to the side of the road, McGee PD. Pull over to the side of the road for me. All right, right up there is good. Yep, right on the curb is good, right there. All right, let's just angle our vehicle a little bit there. That should be good. And we're good. All right, so we're heading north on Polito Boulevard, dispatch. Let's get around over this way. So what I need to do is try to start implementing, you know, the realistic, you know, 5M factor where we do, you know, police patrols. If you guys want, let me know, do you want me to try to be more realistic with these patrols? You know, in 5M, you know, we actually use the 10 codes and everything, which I haven't really done before. I, I used to a little bit here and there. But if you want me to start using the 10 codes more often, let me know. I know a lot of people do that, but uh, yeah, just let me know what you guys think. Let's get over here and speak with the driver of the Hummer here. Hello, ma'am. How's it going today? McGee PD. Get your driver's license, proof insurance, registration, all that good stuff. Kiflong. Thank you. Lily Black, Thanks. born 326-1999. All right, just hang in there, ma'am. All right, so it looks like she is clear. Let's go around here to the driver's side and we'll check out the police computer. Make sure all the information does come back correct. <laughs> all right, so we're gonna do vehicle records, Patriot. All right, looks like valid registration, 31722. Insurance is valid, 111121. And vehicle is not coming back stolen. Uh, dispatch, the vehicle is an ice white Hummer. Uh, I was mistaken on that. Okay. Uh, let's see, age 32, okay, hold on a second, she was arrested in February, oh, last year, for possession of destructive devices, that's a little sus, uh, she was cited in 2018 for broken headlight, committing graffiti, and a failure to signal, okay, well, she hasn't really committed any crimes other than blowing that red light. So let's do it this way. Lily Black, Curtis Citation. All right, so we're just gonna charge her with the running the red light. She did seem to make a complete stop. Doesn't give her the right to go through a red light though. All right, so let's go actions, submit citation. And then we just need to give her the citation. Oh, okay, that's on. We'll ignore the siren being on there. All right, Lily, so I'm just going to have to give you a citation for running that red light back there. 
You understand what you did back there? You do, you're gonna be cooperative? Okay, this is, it's a small ticket, but next time, don't run a red light. You did come to a complete stop, but you can't just drive through the red light. Control, page, down. Here you go, ma'am. Thanks. There is your citation, and then once I get back to my vehicle, you can drive off. Have a safe day, ma'am. Let's just get back to our vehicle here. All right, looks like we're good. All right, dispatch, we're gonna be code four on that traffic stop. Okay, let's get back out on the road here, and we'll see how the day goes. But hope you guys do enjoy the episode. If you do enjoy it, please do hit the like button. Also, at time of recording this, we hit 10,000 subscribers about two days ago. So when I first recorded this episode, we were maybe like 50 subs away from 10,000. But uh, yeah, like I said, I had to refilm this episode, which, eh, you know, it's not too bad. It was there was really one really good incident that happened this episode that I have to, you know, redo. Uh, basically, we did a traffic stop, and I was talking to the driver. I walked back to my vehicle and waited a second to get back inside my car because... Okay, we've got an MVA. Copy that dispatch. Uh, so I waited to get back inside my vehicle because there was an oncoming car, and it was a tight spot. So uh, as soon as that car passed, I w was about to go inside my vehicle, and that driver that we pulled over started shooting at me I took cover behind my car. This car, I don't know if they actually blew the light or not. I think they did. I didn't see it though, so I'm gonna allow that. You know, if you don't see it, there's not much you can do about it. Now, honestly, the dash cam could have caught that, but there is the chance that they just went through the yellow light. So I don't feel like wasting my time with that. Uh, we do have to respond to this MVA too, so. I'm gonna respond code three. All right, dispatch, we're heading west on Polito Boulevard. We'll be arriving on scene uh, right now. Oh, man. What happened to this car? Um, I'm going to pull up in front and flip around just because there's a fire hydrant there. In case a fire starts out, I don't want my car to be in front of that. Wow, what happened? All right, dispatch, I'm on scene. We've got, looks like vehicles occupied times one. It's a dark silver... Uh, what is the Bentley? Can we get a play check on it. It's uh, four f six Eric Eric Keen five seven two. Suspect's license plate. Four, Micah six, Proteski. Owner's license five, is suspended. Seven, two, right, I'm gonna felony. try and get this guy out. Owner's license caution. suspended. I copy that dispatch. Can I grab him here? I want to try to move him where it's a little safer. All right, and then let's try and. Uh, I want to search his body really quick just to make sure he doesn't have anything illegal on him. All right, uh, nothing illegal. Okay, and now we're going to tend to him. I right, dispatch, we're attempting CPR on Micah. Man, I don't know what happened to his car. Jeez, maybe he was spit, speeding and uh, crashed into something. All right, uh, dispatch, I was able to resuscitate Micah. Let's, okay. Can you stand up here, man? All right, I'm gonna ask you a few questions. Have you been drinking today, man? No, I don't. I just wanna make sure because your vehicle was wrecked. Are you doing okay? Is everything good? Oh, uh, you have the right to shut up. Okay. I, I didn't say you did anything illegal, but now do you have anything illegal on you? Anything that's sharp that's gonna stab me, poke me, or stick me? You don't want to go to jail? Okay. In that case, under those circumstances, I'm going to have you place your hands behind your back. You're just being detained right now. You technically haven't committed any crimes yet. We just got to figure out what's going on here with this scene. Because your car is completely wrecked. Okay, so let's see. Question. Where did you come from today, man? You just came from the hospital. Okay, you on some kind of meds or something? Is that why maybe you, you crashed your vehicle? Uh, uh, you have the right to shut up. Okay, I'm guessing you're on meds that you're not supposed to be driving on. Uh, where are you headed to, man? On your way home, okay. Do you live in this neighborhood? No, you live up north more, okay. Uh, sir, do you own that vehicle? 
Yes, okay. So, you know your license is also suspended, so that's probably why you didn't want to speak to me. Uh, so under that, I guess we're just going to get you an ambulance, take you back down to the hospital. I know you said you just came from there, uh, but then you will be going to jail for driving on the suspended license and committing property damage there. So let's get an ambulance for ambulance. him. Assistance I'm going to search his vehicle too. Man, his vehicle is wrecked. That was a really nice Bentley, too. Wait, is this the actual Bentley? Oh, shit, it is the actual Bentley. I forgot I had this installed. Man, I installed this thing a long time ago. But I hope you guys are enjoying the episode so far. If you do enjoy it, please do hit the like button and maybe consider subscribing if you haven't already. An autographed photo of Jack Howitzer, train ticket harmony. Okay, so nothing illegal then. All right, we got the ambulance on scene. Uh, I gotta finish searching this vehicle and then secure the scene for the ambulance so this truck doesn't crash into them. Oh, what a dumbass. Why? Alright, uh, boys, let's get him into the ambulance. I'm gonna try and secure the scene. McGee PD, just hang in there. McGee PD, hang in there, man. Just let the paramedics do their job. They'll be gone in a minute. We got the sheriff over here as well. Alright, thank you, sheriff. Uh, I need to get a transport or a tow truck for this vehicle. So let's do this. Request tow service, and we'll do a large flatbed because I don't think this car is going to be able to, you know, be wheeled to the uh, impound lot. All right, so yeah, we're going to be code four one. Ah, oh, crash, son of a! All right, guys, we are back. We just had to restart Grand Theft Auto. What I'm going to need to do is do either a fresh install. We're trying to update. I just saw that Stop the Ped and Ultimate Backup and whatnot have been updated. So I can try updating that, but I believe we are on an older version of Grand Theft Auto from like a month and a half ago. And uh, like I said previously, the last time I tried to update the game, which was like two weeks ago, uh, basically as soon as I would initialize LSPDFR, we would get nothing but texture loss. And a lot of people were telling me that too that are in the Discord server. Which actually, if you haven't joined the Discord server, Come join the Discord server. This yellow pickup truck looks really sus. They just cut out in front of this Hummer here. Okay, maybe they didn't really cut out in front of them. But I want to get a play check on them. All right, we're just going to follow them, see what they do. Also, let's see first person. Like, the first person is really cool, except in this car, it just the viewing window is just so small. Especially with the lights that we got right in our face, plus the controller box for the lights. Okay, these cars are going pretty quick now. Let's get this open up. The uh, speed check. Okay, we got a vehicle running from us. Dispatch. What the? F Hold up. So we got a vehicle swerving in and out of traffic. We're heading west on U.S. Route One. We're going. How fast are we going right now? I can't get. Let's pitch. There we go. We're going over 67 miles an hour. They just TC'd with the rear end of a semi. Side of the road, the DPD. We're moving to the side of the road right now. Uh, okay, they just crashed into a ditch over there. Well, actually, the side of a mountain. We're just gonna we're just gonna block them in right here. Special. Let me get additional units over here. Code three for traffic stop. Required in the Mountain State Wilderness. Here we go. Driver, step out of the vehicle with your hands up. Keep your hands where I can see them, bud. Keep your hands where I can see them. Keep them up. Get down on the ground. Hands on top of your head. Kneel down. Hands on top of your head. And then interlace your fingers for me. Thank you. No, do not move. All right. Uh, we got additionals on scene. I'm going to search the vehicle really quick. Hi there. It uh, looks like the vehicle is only occupied times one. We've got uh, one suspect in custody. I'm going to search the vehicle now. Burger Ranger over there cuffed him. Got a locked briefcase and a Spider-Man suit. That's interesting. Okay. Man, you know, we haven't used this Jeep in a while either. Hey, brother, how's it going? Okay, sir, do you have anything illegal on you? Anything that's sharp that's going to stab me, poke me, or stick me? I just realized I forgot to do the Miranda rights if I wanted to do this realistically. I'll try to remember for the next episode because I've already forgot for the other calls. Anyways, uh, so he doesn't say he has anything illegal on him. Maybe yes, maybe no. Okay. Uh, you want to tell me where you came from, man? From hell. Okay, and where... Have you been drinking? No, you don't drink. What about drugs? 
No money, no drinks. Okay. Uh, well, you were driving all over the road back there, swerving in and out of traffic, and then you hit a truck back there. What the heck's going on, man? Seriously, what is, what's up? You don't want to answer. Okay. So I'm going to pat you down then. Let's turn around for me. Let's see if he's got anything illegal on him. Doesn't really want to be cooperative. He may have something, he may not. A forged ID card. Okay, it looks like this is a forged ID card to get into the the clucking bell. What? Okay. Why do you have a forged ID card to get into the clucking bell, man? Let's see if we can question him about that. Uh, technically not. Okay. Uh, so you want to tell me what this forged ID card is for clucking bell? You don't need to answer that. Okay, but that's fine. Uh, we're just gonna get a transport unit for you then. Especially a transport unit down to US Route 1. Uh, looks like the park ranger here is gonna take him down to the station. Uh, so I'm gonna have to move my vehicle and we're gonna have to turn. We searched his vehicle already, that's right. Um, we're gonna need to get a tow truck here for it. Request tow service. We'll do a large flatbed. Flatbed, assistance required. In Thank you, dispatch. The Chiliad Mountain State Wilderness. Let's try and move over this way. Man, we scuffed off the paint on the hood there. All right, looks like we got the tow truck arriving on scene and the park ranger is about to drive him down to the station. Uh, so we are gonna be code four on this one, dispatch. Man, I wanted to go after that yellow pickup truck. Oh well. Either way, I hope you guys do enjoy the episode. Please do hit the like button if you do enjoy it. Let's get going down this way, get back into Plato and see what else the day brings. Or should I say McGee? What is this Jeep doing? All right, dispatch, I need a play check on a black Jeep Wrangler. The license is 24 Oceans Adam Edward 267. They're swerving all over the road now. Chalet Derpson, three Edward, citations, two, six, no flags. Seven, no, 1099. All right, dispatch, I'm going to be stopping them over here. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Scroll lock. Okay, now they're starting to book it. Let's blip them here. Sorry, I need to pull over to the side of the road for me. McGee PD. McGee PD, please pull over. Thank you. All right, right there, Skillside. All righty then. Uh, so we are stopped on US Route 1 heading north, uh, just across the street from the sheriff's office, a little bit south. Like if you just look a tiny bit south from the sheriff's office. All right. Um, we should be fine on this side. We'll just go over here then. Hey, sir, how's it going today? McGee Petey. Uh, you know why I stopped you today? Yeah, you were swerving all over the place. You dropped your phone. That's not good, man. You know you're not supposed to be using your phone while driving. Anyways, I'm going to need your driver's license, proof of insurance, registration, all that good stuff. Kiflam. All right, thank you, sir. Uh, Chile Derpson. All right, thank you. Uh, born three, okay, there we go. Okay, everything checks out at the moment. Let's go check the computer database. Uh, vehicle records, it's Mesa. Valid, valid, just double checking the records to make sure he doesn't have any forged documents. All right, and H46, Mountain Han Road, he's been stopped five times. Driving without insurance, broken tail light, driving the wrong way. Okay, so this is possibly a DUI right now. It's not going to be good for him. It's going to be his first arrest. Uh, so we're going to be administering some a field sobriety test to this guy now. All right, sir, can I have you step out of the vehicle for me? I have the you're suspicion that you're under the influence. So if you want to ask a few, if you want to answer some few questions, man. Hold up. All right, so I'm going to ask you, have you been drinking today, man? You've been sober for six months. Okay, do you have any drugs recently? Your, your hands seem to be a little shaky today. Uh, you do drugs from a medical condition. Okay, do you have anything illegal on you, man? Anything that's sharp that's going to stab me, poke or stick me? Maybe yes, maybe no. What? Okay, then. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna ask you to do some field sobriety tests for me. Just follow this pencil tip with your eyes, not your head. So keep your head still, and just follow with your eyes. No, 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 no. Keep your head straight, and just move with your eyes. No, you can't move your head. You... Okay, so so you failed that test. No big deal. No big deal. 
Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Let's go walk and turn test thing. So I'm gonna have you turn around, walk in a straight line, and yeah, let's just walk as straight as possible. Okay, I mean, it's a little sloppy. It's not really walking in one single foot in front of the other, but... Yeah, you failed to walk in a straight line, heel the toe and hands on the side, so that's not looking good either for you. Uh, we got one more test we can do, man. Uh, the one leg stand test. So we're just gonna basically stand and balance on one leg for 10 seconds. No, 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 no. one, 1,000, no, you, you can't do that. Okay, man, so I'm gonna, at this time, you are being placed under arrest for a DUI. You're under arrest. Turn around for me. We can still do a breathalyzer on you. If you consent to that, you do. Okay, just hang in there then. Turn around for me and I'll do a breathalyzer on you then. Let me pull it out right here. All right, and blow, keep blowing, keep blowing. All right, right that's good, thank you, man. Uh, unable to provide a valid breath sample. Okay, we're gonna have to try that again, man. Just blow into it, just keep blowing. So, and blow, keep blowing, keep blowing, keep blowing. All right, let's see. Unable to provide a bell breath sample. Okay, so yeah, at this point you are placed under arrest already. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be appointed to you. Do you understand your rights as they have been read, read to you? It's been a while, it's been a long while since I've done that. I may have botched that up a bit. I really need to practice. Come over here, man. I'm gonna be bringing you down to the station. Uh, and then also before I place you in my vehicle again, I'm gonna ask you, uh, do you have anything illegal on you? Anything that is sharp that's gonna stab me, poke me, or stick me? Like a handgun, a pocket knife, uh, I don't know, uh, a letter opener or something, a fish hook. Maybe yes, maybe no. Okay, so I'm gonna patch you down then, man. Just stand still. Uh, Taurus map and a clown horn. All right, dispatch, show me unavailable. I'm going to get this suspect down to the station. Get you in the rear seat here. Just watch your head on the door there. Yep, that's good. And let's get the door closed. Now then, we need to search his vehicle, see if he's got anything illegal in it. Because it's gonna have to get impounded now for a DUI. Uh, suitcase full of toys. Oh, a suitcase full of toys. Okay, bad dragon. Uh, let's close that there. And let's get a tow truck. Tow truck. Uh, this one will do a large tow truck. The flatbeds are a little tied up. Oh my goodness, seriously, a flatbed just drove by as I said that. I guess we could have got a flatbed. Oh well, he's going somewhere else it looks like. Uh, dispatch, we are gonna be code four on this. We're gonna be returning to base. Uh, returning to station, do the same thing. Uh, let's close that there. We're returning to the station with one suspect in custody. Um, let me get my turn signal on. There we go. We're just wow. Is his brakes on? Oh my man! Natural vision valve. Look at that. That's amazing. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, yeah, his brakes are on. I feel really bad for that Jeep now. Uh, so let's get back inside here and get this guy dropped off. Just gonna go around to the back of this station. And we'll bring him in ourselves. Hey boys, how's it going today? You guys are just chilling with some coffee. Oh, I could go for some coffee right now. Hold on a second. Mmm. Coffee. Also, save 10% on Juju Energy down in the description below. Use the discount code MikeGoldenGames at checkout. And we're going to release the guy here from the cuffs. All right, but so you're just gonna be staying here till you can get a lawyer. And uh, yeah, have a nice rest of your day. Try to sober up and uh, don't drink and drive again, man. It's really dangerous. You are swerving all over the place. And yeah, your Jeep, oof. You're probably gonna need new tires. They're gonna be completely flat on one part of the tire. Okay, so let's get back outside the station and do the outro.
All right, guys, I'm going to leave this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you thought in the comments below. Maybe consider subscribing if you haven't already, as well as hitting the little bell icon on the channel. That way you stay notified when the videos go up and when we do live streams. And be sure you join our Discord server. Take it easy, guys. Thank you.